Here we are. Okay. United. Five Four years, quarter. 21 altitude, what was the altitude? Really off out. Uh -huh. Woo! I know. Beautiful clear day today. The snow was smooth. It wasn't that cold. You can see perfectly. I hit like two rails all day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Couldn't even hit the jump because it's complete flat light. I need to keep up with my man here. I need to keep up with him. I was trying to yesterday, snowboarding. What is up, it's your boy Johnny Shreve, live BB Pro. I'm gonna tell it like it is. This is a reunion. It's been five years since I've seen my boy years. last. We were young, dumb, full of fun. But today we're gonna hit some, uh, some legs today. Yeah. We're gonna put up some really good, you know, some cues there for you guys to, you know, take and apply to yourselves when you're training at home, so. Just do what, you, do what you do, like focus on like just really squeezing active and get like, like you should be tired of your first set. Yeah. Just from activation, so we don't gotta go super heavy. Ah. So Canadian of you to wear a in the gym. I'm trying to make a trend here. So this is perfect here, driving hips in the ground. You see the eyes flush on. His glutes are pushing right into the hips. It's perfect. Stage ready hamstrings already hold. Stretch, good. Nice. I used to be so accustomed to training high reps, and then I started training like six to eight, and then I went back and I'm like, 15, the first 10 reps, I, I don't even know what to think. <laughs> I'm like, it's too much. I'm so used to just, I always do a high rep. I'm always pushing the load as much as I can possibly push it within that high rep range. Yeah. I was always trained like that way. It yield better results for me. If I, the heavier I go, the more my joints can all. So, what's your thoughts on like having a little bit of lumbar extension on it? Is it fine as long as it stays in one place throughout the movement? Because I know like a lot of the machines are built, so you can't really set yourself into posture. Pelvic like, tilt. like you're talking like here. Yeah. That's what I want. Yeah. The ladder is is too much flexion. Yeah. And then you're just basically using like your glutes to pull yeah, the yeah. weight up. Right, so like that's why if you and you probably feel way more just like I do, when your hips are gr like grinding in there yeah. and the flush on, your hamstrings that much are activated. I always do this like thing like this. So you like take, take your feet like this and set them back like that. So knee behind, and then just flex here like that. Yeah. Right now my hamstring is like, like cramping, like hard. Yeah. I do this. It's like there's nothing to it. Get 10 to 15. I'll I'll keep you up. You just keep the tempo. Keep the tempo. I'll keep your. I'll help you with the concentric. You control the negative always. There you go. Good. Lock in. All in, that's uh, good. Two, drive in, drive in, drive in, there you go. Uh, one more, one more, one more, you got you, and slow down. Up, 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 good. Control down, that's it. Good, 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 good. Right? Oh, that's good. <laughs> about, about snowboarding tomorrow. Come on, push. He had like 15 more. <laughs> At least. My hamstring's on the ground twitching. <laughs> Good. Relax a bit. Drop that like all the way down. 40, 50? Yeah, oh yeah. Point toes. Almost like point them to you point and touch. There you go. Oh, close like you're doing hamstring, uh, dumbbell hamstring curls. Oh, okay, I see. Yeah, pull up. Oh, that inner hamstring. <laughs> right? Oh. There you go. That's it. Just drive it up. You got it. I got you. There you go. Uh. Nice. Come on, push. Uh. Good. One more. One more. Drive up, drive up, drive up. Uh. Good. Yeah. Oh, what the? <laughs> right? Like people are always like, I can't feel my hamstrings. That's the one movement my brother taught me that literally gave me the mind-muscle connection with the hamstrings was doing a dumbbell 
and flying control, leg. Yeah. yeah. The best movement. Yeah. You got full abduction to your right feet, then you got plantar yeah. flexion, and you're, oh, you're already active is doing this. And then pulling up, man. Clean out leg extension. Three sets? Yeah, same. Don't waste your time doing like eight, nine sets just to do your feeler sets and whatnot, right? We're already primed. My hamsters are done. Yeah, so now we only have RDL seated leg. <laughs> know, right? We're just isolating right now. So I like get it all the way up and just and almost like doing a crunch, but not crunching over. It's like if you do a leg a leg lift. Okay. And, <sighs> Walls are so ridiculous. They've downsized. <sighs> yeah, they look insane though. <laughs> Do you keep your toes just straight? Yeah, keep them locked and then don't, I want you, I want you, I want you to, to throw it up because you got strength, squeeze it up. Like, think, like you're literally just doing leg extensions, like knee extension, there you go. There's no like push my hand, hand away, yeah. Push your hand away, there you go. There you go, good. Good, one more, one more, one more. Squeeze, good. People think like when you're essentially lowering something, it's just this kind of like dropping it. Yeah. Or for me, I'm pulling it. So I'm doing a hamstring, almost like a seated hamstring curl as my eccentric. When I'm down, then I'm controlling both ways. I do that with the arms. Like when exactly, you yeah. Up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No fear. Breathe, come on, push. These cables are a bitch, eh? <laughs> and I'll go up and wait. It's not being a pussy. Drop, you, yo, drop it if you need to, I don't care. Feel that like from shin to like your hip flexor. Cool, you can speed your negative up a little bit more. There, control, there you go. Let it stretch it. Uh, let it pull underneath. Drive it up, there, perfect. Two. Good, one more. Push, good. Tristan's strong. Not strong for his side, he's strong. I think strength is like when you can control each movement consistently and it's a very heavy or moderate weight, that's strong. Anyone can fling weight around. Sometimes you gotta put a little bit of load on, especially like the bigger muscles to help you kind of weight yourself into the stretch. This is 45 pound bar with 225 pound block of hunk of muscle. So I'm gonna need a little bit more just to keep me into my proper range of motion and feel it active. It's probably eight to six to eight, 10. Just control it. Control it, and then as soon as your speed's going, on the way up, yeah. and just stop your rep. Here you go. Drive, boom, nice. Drive, that's it, come on. Drive. Four, there you go. Drive, nice. Heart, good, come on, heart, up. Nice, good. One more. Push. Nice work. If we're grinding out of here, if we're like, oh, then we're done. Think like I'm gonna punch in the stomach this entire time. Your hips are back a little bit. Like that? Slightly, yeah. There, you go, slightly and over. Boom. Push up. Easy weight. Push up. Good. Jive knees up, jive knees up. Oh, oh, push, there you go. One more, one more, come on. Drive, 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 good. You see the difference? It's just more stable. A little slight difference, you can see how much more explosive you are. Yeah. From that, for, especially from, the, from that bottom.
whether you're doing it fast or slow, controlled, whatever, it's being like engaged. I don't know what it is. I think it's because for a long time, my only cue was like, try to stop and ease forward, because I was trying to hit just yeah. straight up quad. Obviously with a barbell squat, it's different than a high squat, you know? Drive, 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 good. Come on. Drive. Good. Come on. Drive. There you go. Drive. Good. Drive, drive, drive. Good. Good. Drive. Good. Good. One rep after, like it clicked the forward position. Yeah, yeah. You tell the most when you're out of the hole, right? If you're not, if you're, just try, I do, do all the time with my clients. I'm like, sit down. I'm like, sit down like this. Yeah. And try and stand up. Like here. Do this. Just from a little bit of an angle, right? I feel like if he stays you upright, it forces you to drive back and then up. Yeah. Already else? Yeah. Get these quads gone because the toast. They're done. Push those toes right in the ground. Grip the floor with the toes. Pull yourself up. There you go. Nice. Come on. There you go. That's it. Come on. Drive toes, drive toes, there you go. Perfect. Push through, that's it. There you go. Shift back, that's it. Grip toes, push through, push through, core, 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 drive. There you go, it. Drive through, drive, hips, good. Nice. So the same thing here, people try to do with their heels. They got no drive force by their hips. It's like good luck. So grip your toes and you can pull yourself, it's like you're pulling yourself through. Yeah. Both your hands and your toes are doing the same thing. Twenty-five minutes, legit training, and some quality content, and then we stretch. The hips need it. Oh my god! Like I've been inspired by Tristan since I met him. He's one of the he's one of the one of the bigger people I've been looking up to. He's twenty-one. You know how it is. I've had this for four years as well. That's not since a little bit after when we first met. It's the mindset, it's the mentality, right? If you guys using those cues that we've done today, guys, make sure you guys let me know in the comment section below. Gotta thank my boy Tristan for coming on the channel. Thanks for having me. It's been a long time coming, man. It's been this, a five year reunion. <laughs> it's pretty cool to watch Tristan go in these last five years. He is a fitness idol and mogul. Thank you. 100% real time. Anyway. Thank you, brother. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, guys. If you did, make sure you guys like, subscribe, and share. You know, become what the talent it is, transparent, vulnerable with truth. If you guys, the coaching, johnnyshee.com. If you want to know more about my coaching, guys, book yourself a 15 or 30 minute consult. And any consult, I deduct off any package that you pick. I'll see the description below for those discount codes and promo codes that will save your life or change your life for the better. Like Johnny Fan for 10% off BruceRNewSoogles.com. And guys, add me on Instagram, and TikTok, and Snapchat. And I'm a boy on everything else, because you probably add him anyway. So you know how it is. Iron Sharp is Iron. Progressive overload your life. In the meantime, keep dream chasing. That's it. In another life, you'd be an auctioneer.